Welcome to the After the Show show. Patty Loveless is here, along with her great band, family as we call it. Well, where, where did half of them go? <laughs> well, a couple of them, I think they had to go take a nap. Seriously? Oh, early this morning. They were up, you guys were up at 3 They don't want to play your next tune? Hey guys, we're still doing a show over here. But these guys will do just fine. Okay. Trust okay. me. You've got me. two fiddles on this one. Well, yeah. Right. Well, if you count the big one. Very nice. Uh, <laughs> a lot of strings. That's an interesting bass strings. strings. Is it true that when you were a little girl, you, I, I read this on uh, Country Music uh, website, that you were so, you know, afraid or, you know, a little shy, afraid of crowds, that you would sing to company, but you would only sing to them if you could sing from the other room? Right. My mother would invite family over, our cousins, just anybody that she could drag into the house to hear her daughter sing. But I was so shy that I would run and hide behind, well, not behind, but beside the refrigerator. Mm -hmm. And... Uh, I just felt comfortable there in the kitchen. So you would sing and then, from the And then, and then, then the I would kitchen. sing as loud as I could from the kitchen. Right? So they'd be so in the living room. I wouldn't have to see, you know, but like I'm looking at you now. And <laughs> well, it's not a bad idea that you I've have to sing better. louder, right? <laughs> well, how, did, how did you overcome that? Oh, gosh. That's a good question. Uh, you she know, does. I, she does it? Uh, it. Let's go to the heart of the matter over here for the yeah. real truth. That's the, and how, that how did she truth. overcome it? She knows me very well. She's been with me for about 11, 12 years now, so she knows me well. <laughs> You know, honestly, so you still if, battle you, it. if you don't get excited about it, yeah, you still, yeah. but you've got to have that excitement in order because that's what encourages you and, exactly. and, and, and inspires you to, to put your voice into the music. So. Mm -hmm. Now, during our uh, cable show, you were talking a little bit about uh, the fact that you are a coal miner's daughter. Your dad took you to the Pollyanna Drive-In for your first right. taste of live music. You thought that you were going to see a movie. Uh, and like Loretta Lynn, your father was a coal miner, but you, you mentioned a uh, COPD, and that's a, an issue close to your heart. Right. That's something else I've been working with lately. Um, I, I didn't know what COPD stood for until I got involved. And, and boy, I, I just I, I look back on the year 1996. My sister, um, she passed away with emphysema. She was only 48 years old. Mm -hmm. An amazing singer, a wonderful singer. We used to love to sing together and make music together. And, and to lose her at such an early age. And she, um, emphysema is one form of COPD, which mm -hmm. stands for chronic obstructive pulmonary disease. Mm -hmm. I said it so fast early on. But it, uh, another form of it is chronic bronchitis. And so many people know. But to find out more information about it, if you go to um, drive, the number four, COPD.com, uh, they have a lot of information there, and you can take a, a screener, mm -hmm. five questions, I've done it, okay. and to see if you might be at risk for this, and if you do, you know, just take the results to your doctor in your own personal We actually time. had Bruce Jenner on the show, um, he, who, when they kicked off that drive campaign good, good. Uh, earlier, yeah, just maybe so, about a month ago so or so. Bruce definitely, uh, he was so informative uh, mm -hmm. out there, and he was very helpful. And Belushi, right? Mm -hmm. And was Jim, Jim Belushi. Jim Belushi was okay. here as well. Okay. Well, that. yeah, yeah. Because now, then I think about it, we were in New York back in February, mm -hmm. but it's. Well, thanks just... for stopping by. <laughs> <laughs> She's not by now. <laughs> I had a kind of Oh, thank you. <laughs> and, and, and a lot of your fans said, "Hey, we loved that kind of voice and tone you had when you did Mountain Soul." And so now you're doing Mountain Soul, too. I am. And this uh, song that, uh, that I'd like to do for you now is, is a song that Emmylou Harris and Paul Kennelly wrote together. And Emmylou Harris, you know, uh, everybody knows who the great sure. Emmylou is. Mm -hmm. And uh, I adore her. Um, she, she did come in and sing on this particular song. But, uh, of course, we couldn't have Emmy here today. So okay. I have to do without her, and I hope I do a good job. All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, here she is, Diamond in the Crown by Patti Love. Let's check it out on Mountain Soul 2. We'll get out. Okay.
That was fantastic. <laughs> Patty Loveless, check out the new CD, Mountain Soul 2, available everywhere. Patty and everybody, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you too. See you tomorrow.